Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Super Mario Bros. Wonder. Now we've gone through the three ruins of the mines, and fungo mines. Let's talk to the Poplin again. Fantastic, you discovered the way through that place. Now I can finally reach my friends. Thank you for everything you've done to get this far. Let's find them. Very well said. But first, let's go to the KO arena. Fungi Funk. <coughs> just clearing my throat. It's fine. Um, I don't know what I want to, want to use for this. Let me just. Now I'll keep the. I'll keep the grappling vine, for the moment. I think I do want to keep the bubbles, but I also might want elephant fruit. So let me grab that and see how this goes. Actually, I might have wanted the other one. Okay, so I need to activate the light. Like that, and pull this up. And around. Also need to get this boo into the light. This is not going well. Need to actually lure them in a bit more. Come on, here we go. That was not very fast, but that's okay. Four levels and we've already taken 21 seconds. <coughs> this should be easier. Just need to time it right. Which seems to be timing itself for the moment. Oh boy. How do I get up? Oh, the platforms go up just randomly. That makes sense. Let me just quickly grab power up. And go. Okay, doors. Which ones are the fake ones? Also, there's just ones in the background as well, so we need to actually try some of these doors. That's a really rude. There's only two that we need to find. Is this just taking us down? Oh my goodness, where is... Where is... There's one. There's the other one. They also didn't take him out. I see. I'm definitely not going to get this first try, I don't think, because I'm taking too long. We still have another error to go. It just didn't explain that we had to go through... I don't know. It should have just been obvious to me. Okay, 74 seconds. Can we do the last room? Quickly. 77 seconds. I don't like these odds. Please go down. Where's the last one? There. Go down. 93 seconds. I feel like that's not good, but we might be okay if it's like 100 seconds. Or more. 97 seconds. It might have been 95, actually. It was 90. Okay. So we have to do that again. It's weird because I didn't have this much trouble last time, but I don't know how I... I don't know. Anyway. <laughs> let's just do it again. Do it the same, but better. Might also switch badges or something? I don't know. Not that it really matters. Maybe the speed, the fast dash, so I can just run faster. Bubble seems to do well. Let me do that again. Just more bubble. Also, maybe drill? Drill might have been good. Okay. Almost. There we go. I don't know how to do that more efficiently. Apparently. 19 seconds for the first room, that's pretty alright. Oh, does it go up when we're standing on it? That makes sense. I should have really realized that sooner. But that's okay, 32 seconds. We're still going good. We still have a little bit of power. So next up should be doors, which we can do much faster since we actually know what we're doing. The doors are different. Cool. It's interesting that they are able to do that. Ah, uh, that's rude. Just go for it. 
37 seconds. We can get to the last room. It should be fine. We just need to get through all the slime. 60 seconds. Bubbles really help a lot. Please go down. Go down! I keep accidentally ground pounding out of the ins back into the slime. <clears throat> okay, swim, 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 swim. We're good. Nice. I don't know how I got that first try my last time. Maybe I didn't, I just don't remember. I don't know. Toad's gone. I do actually have a lot of wonder- no, flower coins right now. But anyway, getting close to the end. Operation Poplin Rescue. Let's go save him. Let's save him. With the power of slime! I'll save him! Love how we just destroy all these blocks like this. But also we can go through the walls and stuff to get around. So cool. Oh, and there's the Wonder Seed. There we go, all clear. Whoa! Yay, we've been rescued! We wanted to help you save the kingdom, Prince. So we searched everywhere for a royal seed. And we found one! Hopefully you can uh, get rid of that bad guy with it. Wow, you came all the way down here to help me. I feel so thankful they found one for us. Let's take it. You got a royal seed! Oh, thank you. Alright, everyone, let's head home. And so, Toad's party f saved the fungi mines from a dire fate. With the royal- with the fifth royal seed in hand, there is only one left to recover. The final raw seed is said to be among the molten pools of deep magma bog. Good luck, your highness, and good luck, Toad. You must meet this challenge. Save the Flower Kingdom and the world from Bowser's evil plans. It does indeed. Congratulations, you got all the wonder seeds in the fungi mines. Here's another hundred flower coins. Alright, let's return to the petal isles. It's a quick ascent, so your ears might pop. Wow, we've done a lot. Hooray! Those poplins in the mines were really, really helpful. We can't stop now. Let's hurry and track down the next Royal Seed. Well, let's quickly talk to our friendly fisherman, Poplin. Hello! Whoa, that guy is so menacing up there. You can't let him get the best of you, Prince. I just can't catch any fish at all, but I did reel in this bottle with this curious message inside. Look to the distant sky to find a special world. Huh? What do you suppose that's all about? I don't know, but we didn't also find 
an entrance to the special world in the Fungi Mines. So let's head back, since we got kicked out of the world immediately, as we always do. Uh, also, let me just check a few things, because I never go back to some of these places, but they do seem to have special text when you go back to some places. Thank you, thank you, thank- Oh, thank you. You saved everyone. Was the sensor badge I gave you as helpful as I hoped? That badge works in other worlds too, so keep that in mind. As for everyone else, they all went back into the mines. I told them they needed to stay away from the deep deep parts. I'm sure it'll be fine. Well, pretty sure anyway. Sounds like they got lost again. Let's uh, head back down and save them. It's a bit of a track that they took, but it's sort of not that long once we go through it this quickly. Wow. <laughs> Operation Rescue the Poplins again, because we can't need to. <laughs> Why did they get themselves stuck again? I already got the royal seed. Oop, getting stuck on things. Let's try to go quickly and it did not help. There we go. And there we go. Let's see what their excuse is this time. They're shaking. Ah! Yay, now we can get out of here. We figured this was uh, still a great place for mining. So we've been coming back down here now and again. You fools. Are you kidding me? You don't all don't learn, do you? How many times do I have to remind you how dangerous it is down here? Time to go home. Go. Yeah, you tell them. I'm sure they'll all enjoy mining, but this is a little ridiculous. Got an extra path though that they unlocked, which is the entrance to the special world, which that should be everything in the world now. I've not been checking to make sure I got everything, which I didn't apparently get in Sunbake Desert, so I have to head back there and see what I accidentally missed. Uh, I, yeah, I don't know how I managed that. Anyway, special world. Fungi Mine Special, Dangerous Donut Ride, 5 star difficulty. What could possibly go wrong? Oh no. Oh no. We're falling blocks and also need to collect things probably. I was trying to bounce off of that guy's head but it did not work. Nope, 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 it's fine. Just deal with it. Oh, they actually just they actually disappear after a bit. Also, how am I supposed to there we go. That's fine. Oh no. Please go down before more spawn in. Also, I got rid of that one. Nice. Grab that 10 coin. Wonder flower, okay. Now we're falling, in style. And we need to get things along the way. And dodge the wall of death. This is fine. I don't like the enemies dropping. That's very concerning. Okay, get all these coins. Dodge the death. And there's the Wonder Seed. The only reason I made it through that was because I just gave up on some of the platforms and just went for it. And hoped to get to the next platform. I don't know how that worked. Anyway, we also need to not die to these enemies. And still get the top of the flagpole. Also love the rain. I love the rain. Love the rain. I need to say that a lot because it's so good. The rain is so good. Course clear. Yay! 
And while we're here, I think I should probably spend some of my flower coins I've collected. Since we have almost the limit, which I think is 999, I assume. There's still a few more things we haven't seen yet that are revealed in these standees. So if you want to avoid that, now's the time to avoid that. But let's get all of these. We can probably skip through it a little bit faster as well. Just a little bit. 71 out of 170, no, 144. We have half of them now. There are so many. But now we can actually see that we've, like, we've seen most of these versions of the characters now, which is really cool. We've seen the drills, we've seen the, the Goombas. Also, I'm spoiling things, but also we've seen them already, so. <laughs> we've got the balloons, the, the hoppy cat, the bubbles, the ho just everything, basically. It's really good. Okay, I kind of want to stop around here, probably. 89 out of 144. And we still have all of these characters- no. All of these four characters left. Five- five characters left. So we're gonna need some more flower coins still. Uh, but let's head back to the Petal Isles. Because we're about to get to what is my favorite level in the game. Which is probably obvious to, as to why it is my favorite level in the game. But also, it's just really cool in general. Uh, let me do the badge challenge first. Boosting Spin Jump 1. This one's also quite interesting. They're all interesting. But this should be very... Reminiscent of Mario Galaxy. While in midair, press R or shake the controller to gain a little extra altitude. So we can now spin jump to get a little bit higher. We can get quite high if we do it just right. No, don't do that. Why did you do that? Why did you do that? Oh, it's fine. Also, love the rain. Rain good. Also, is there a thing hidden behind one of these pipes? I should have probably been more careful, but it's fine. Also, apparently that was spinning those. I did miss one. That's fine. We'll come back for it. So I kind of need to actually hold these pipes down a little bit more. So I can actually get to things. That's why they're there. That's not, it's not just some kind of trick. Anyway. Got to the end of the world. Level. Also, those, like, mountain tablet things look really cool. The backgrounds always have really cool details. Nice, done. we just got the badge user's gift. Do you want me to wear it? Uh, I guess so. Also, we're, like, right in front of the Bowser. We're right in front of him. Also, it's very ominous sounding. With the music. Now, let me see where I missed the the 10 coin, because it's probably going to be extremely obvious. And I just missed it because I wasn't hitting or holding down the pipes as long as it was supposed to. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot more secrets that are showing up when you actually hold these down. It's crazy how that happens. Anyway. Let's, uh, speed through the rest of this. We don't need- we don't even need the top of the flagpole. We can almost get that without the extra stuff there. But there we go. And now we can get to my favorite level of the game. Muncha Fields. It's raining, which is a good start to why I love this level. And also we have Bowser in the background being the most ominous version of Bowser ever. Oh, he's so huge. Just watching us. Super massive Bowser. But anyway, we have all these munches that we can't really do much about unless we... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Just have to avoid them, basically. 
get the blocks from the other side of where they are. So I think we were supposed to get a elephant power up from that, but I didn't because I didn't have power. Also, they're just watching from the foreground. You can use power blocks to get rid of them. Now, I th think I need the power block over here, which just keeps spawning from that pipe, so we can get rid of these. Now let the pipes go up, and we can get the 10 coin. Nice. So also a pipe there. That I want to get, somehow. We just need a whole bunch of this other stuff. I think that will activate it, there we go. So now we can go back to the foreground. I love the foreground background as well. It's so cool, but anyway, we get the star power here. Allowing us to run across these... Munches. Get some more star powers to keep it going. Get a 10 coin. Activate this flower. I think there's also a... Yeah, there's another one of these here. Let's grab that and keep going. Run, Toad, run. There we go. Nice. Just a few extra coins that we could grab, but we don't need them. Also, a hidden block. Cool. I'll take that. This is such a cool level. I just I just love the atmosphere of it. Also got the melon piranha plants. Okay, there's a glow there. He's going Super Saiyan! <laughs> it's fine. Now I think what I want to do here is actually ground pound on this. And the star should bounce around. I don't know if this is what you're supposed to do, but we can grab it for like that. Go down here, and hit this. Wonder flower. And now the platform is alive. <laughs> and everything is shadows, which is really cool. This platform's alive as well. Basically the platforms will try to follow where you are. So we just need to keep moving. Also look at the background. Because that entire chunk of level is moving. The entire thing. Let's try and keep up with it, because it's, it's going quite quick. Well, that's not in the background. That, 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 that is in the background. Also, if we stand on this, we get flung to the background. And now we can travel on this giant block. Try and get as much as we can along the way. That. That's nothing, okay. Got a lot of power blocks here that we can use. Let's try that. And that should allow us to get to the seed. This is just a cool level. <laughs> I like all of it. It's so good. Anyway. I think this is also a s no, it's not a secret path. But there is also, if we do it right, destroy some of these. I don't think we can break the stairs here, which is good. We can just get rid of the munches on them. We can go down this way, get the last 10 coin. There we go. Now we can get to the end. Spin! Oh my goodness. Pow! So there we go. I just really like that level. I don't know... I can't nail it down to one thing probably, but it's it's probably mostly the rain. Just so good. But anyway, with that, I'd also like to go back to the Sunbaked Desert and check what I actually missed there. I don't know how I missed something there. Because I was, I was, I was so certain that I got everything. There might be something hidden that I just didn't see. Or maybe there's not just one of the levels I didn't get everything in. Oh, I did miss a thing, okay. I just never went back for a 10 coin. That explains why I missed something and didn't realize it. Valley full of... Valley full of snootles. I was too busy thinking about the name and laughing about it. Probably. Find the secret here. Just 
need to find the 10 coin. Wherever it may be. Which might be down one of these pipes, actually. Because you never check the pipes unless you do. There it is. Ow. Grab that, thank you. And I'm out of here. Also, this part of the level without the slow motion is very casual. Not that the slow motion makes it difficult, but it's very different. Just very different. Also, the spin is quite nice for getting through levels quickly. But there we go, that should actually be everything in the world now. There we go, that's better. Uh, so let's head over back to the... Uh, the area we just were. And we can keep going. Uh, I think we will do the regular race first. Spelunking. Four star difficulty. Interesting. Oh, well, speed is everything. Recommended. This is probably not going to go well for me, but that's fine. Just going to run and run fast. Go! Just need to make sure I find secrets, probably. Because I think we still have to find the 10 coins, don't we? Also, I think we really needed the badge for this. Just to keep up with everything. Turn around. Yeah, he's going really fast. Nice timing. Maybe we don't need to find 10 coins, which is probably good for me because I would have missed them already. That was dangerous. It's fine. And goal. 48 seconds. How long do we have to wait though? Not long. Good thing we went fast. Right. Now we go and we've looped it all the way around to back to the beginning of the world. Opening up a special world warp by the looks of it. We did it, we won the race. We won the race, just win, just win, just win the race. And Wiggle even celebrated our victory by giving us a Wonder Seed. Rivals turned friends, racing is amazing. Let's take a look at this KO arena though. Petal Metal. Metal Petal. Petal Metal. Ah, uh, let's not boost badge that, let me fast dash. Five flowers probably good. Let's also go elephant. It's gotta actually be good at one of these. Again. Also, I don't want to swim this way. I probably want a, a different badge for this action now that I think about it. It's fine. Oh wait, the water's going down, okay. Gotta go fast, faster. Up. Yeah, I probably definitely want a different badge for this. I don't know what though. Okay, this is fine. Also got the power block, which would probably help. If I actually use it. That was satisfying. Nice. Just keep going. Okay, more mores. They are many. Nice, that was good. I like that. Very, I'm very pleased with that attempt. Elephant actually worked pretty well for that. 80 seconds was the requirement for the last 10 coins, so we did pretty good.
I did it! Now, let me just take a look at the, the warp quickly to the special world. I can't remember what this was. This might actually be a bad idea, isn't it? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Petal Isles special, Way of the Goomba. I struggled with this one a lot. This is not gonna go well for me. I think I want Cap to start this. See you later. This is fine. Actually, might have wanted to spin. But we have to do this whole level as Goomba. And not die. We can also run into the edges of these. Which is fine. I want that 10 coin as well. Jump! Missed it. I just don't want to get crushed. How? I have to be like right on the edge and jump at the last second. There we go. And the worst part about this is if we die, we have to go all the way back to the beginning. Jump. Just keep jumping so we don't fall. I don't know if I believe in me for this. I struggled so much with this. Died so many times. I feel like I have to go from up to down. Maybe I don't. <laughs> I still got it. Also, hang on. Let me... Spin. Because spin is actually really good at this point. It's gonna really help us get through things faster. It's just such a really good badge. But anyway. Let's do this again. Go, 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 go. Oh my goodness. It's so dangerous. It's so dangerous. Regret. Flashbacks intensify. Thank you for the belief. I appreciate the belief. Just keep it up. It's fine. But now we have this as well to dodge. Oh my goodness. But we came all this way, and we can still definitely die. And now we have to bounce off of these bubbles to get through. Oh my goodness, there's still so much chance of dying here. And having to go back through the whole thing again. I really want the 10 coin. Greed! I made it! I can't believe it! Oh my goodness. Past me is crying right now. Well, I'm out of here. Not willing to miss that flagpole. Because doing that again would be the absolute worst. Okay. Anyway, I think that's probably it for now. Oh. Just let me recover from that. So, uh, thank you all for watching, and I'll see y'all next time. My favorite level and my least favorite level in one go. Oh my goodness.